Skyrim 47 by Bizarre Bob. Don't forget to subscribe. The following footage was posted by Rochelle G, who had caught something disturbing while exploring an abandoned house. The house used to belong to a happily wed couple who were known as the Evan Roots. But then one night, something very tragic happened to the couple. Mr. and Mrs. Evan Root were relaxing at home when out of nowhere, an intruder breaks in and kills them both. Uh, the couple's family was devastated upon hearing about pinto. this. They decided to not sell the house out of respect for the couple. But after a while, they decided to rent out the property. However, renters complained of strange occurrences, some of which are just creepy. From drastic temperature changes to seeing shadow-like figures standing outside their window, renters had enough reason to leave the place. The house has been abandoned ever since. That is until Rochelle goes inside and begins to record. She hopes to capture footage of the strange occurrences reported by tenants. But, little does she know that something very unsettling would be caught on camera. This is what she caught. Oh. Eh, but you're going to go Rochelle continues to explore, but something downright creepy is caught on camera without her noticing. Be sure to pay close attention, or you'll miss it. Oh, oh, oh. Wala tayo makakita. Wait, tumakbo. Parang kamay. Ang laki. As Rochelle pans the camera to the door, a silhouette of what appears to be a hand can be seen in the corner. It is only seen for about a second before quickly disappearing behind the doorway. Rochelle walks over to where the hand was spotted, but when she gets there, the space is empty. Mm. Now that's creepy. Now what's even more unsettling about this is the fact that the hand appears at the spot where Miss Evanrood had been found dead. Could it be that Miss Evanrood's apparition was caught on camera? Or was something else caught instead? Perhaps this might have been a squatter who was spying on Rochelle, but given that the space where they were seen is cornered with no exit, it isn't certain as to what exactly was captured. One thing's for sure though, Rochelle doesn't plan on coming back to this place, Tama. as what was seen on footage has left her spooked. Tama. This next video was posted on YouTube in 2010. However, the channel on which the video was uploaded has been deleted for unknown reasons. The video shows footage of an 8mm film. Now at first glance, the footage appears to be normal, but there's actually something very odd about this clip. The person who uploaded the video states that his dad had found this footage in his garage. His father states that his dad had shot this video at a secluded forest during a family trip. It was shot 40 years ago and it was just recently that he noticed something strange in the footage. According to him, an old lady appears in the background. Yet, he is certain that no one was there at the- Tao ba yan? Tingin nyo? Comment nga dyan sa baba. Ang ginagawa niya, parang nakaganun pa eh. Di ba? The following video doesn't have much info, but like with most videos, this one speaks for itself. The video starts off with two employees who appear to be working late at night. One of them, who's named Curtis, states that the building at which they work is haunted. Lot Lots of strange occurrences have taken place inside this building, but it's the second floor where most activity occurs. As Curtis talks to his co-worker, a strange noise is heard on the second floor. 
Knowing that one of them would eventually have to check out the noise, Curtis volunteers to go upstairs. But, as soon as he arrives, he seems to regret the fact that he chose to go alone. It isn't clear why Curtis brought a camera with him, but it might be that he wanted to capture footage of something paranormal, considering that the building is said to be haunted. As Curtis walks around the floor, he captures this. It appears that Curtis has caught someone or something hiding inside one of the rooms. It wasn't until later that he noticed the dark figure when looking back at the footage. What makes this even more creepy is that whatever this was had vanished before Curtis walked inside to check the room. Just like viewers, Curtis has no idea as to who or what this could have been. Now this wasn't the only thing that was caught on camera. Curtis had caught something else without even noticing. Early in the video, as he passes by a door, there appears to be a figure hiding from Curtis. Could this have been the same figure from before? Or was it just a piece of furniture? It's yeah, unclear as to what this might have been, but because this place is believed to be haunted, it might be something else. But of course, feel free to share what you think. What exactly had Curtis caught on camera? Uh, you know? <laughs> if you caught something creepy on camera, so, video, send me Maria Flores had posted the following video and states that the footage isn't hers, but rather someone else's. According to her, someone had sent her the video with very little information. Now the video itself is pretty creepy. The person who sent it states that their sister-in-law was recording a video at a carnival in Africa. However, something very strange was caught on camera by the sister-in-law who shot this. It wasn't until later that she noticed what she had caught. Pay very close attention to this one. Oh, I don't want to get that The following video was shot by Sierra Rose, who had paid a visit to an abandoned asylum. According to her, there was an overwhelming sensation of sadness and dread that she and her boyfriend felt while exploring the place. She also adds that they felt an intense energy surrounding them. The footage shot by Sierra might just prove that there was something there with them. This is what she caught.
Ang sexy ng boses ni ate. Bagay, natatakot eh. Yun nga, pwede yung anino niya, pero anino nang nasa likod niya siguro. Pero hindi eh, dapat dadaan sa kaharapan niya yun. Kasi diba, kung anino niya yun, yung reflection, gaganon sa kanya. Titigil, makikita yung reflection niya. Pwede siguro ilaw, kaya yun. The shadow-like apparition is seen moving on camera. The figure moves from left to right before quickly disappearing. Sierra believes that a ghost was caught on camera. Viewers think so too. But as with most videos, it's not certain if that's the case. As always, I leave it to you to come up with your own conclusion on this footage. Rewatch the clip and see what you think. Ano sa tingin nyo? Multo? Anino? The following image was submitted by Tulsa Polk, who writes, A really good friend of mine had sent me this photo, but I kind of wish they hadn't, because I can't stop thinking about it. The photo they sent me shows two friends who are posing in front of a camera. If you look really closely behind them, you will see the part of the picture that I can't stop thinking about. Here's the photo that was sent to Tulsa. Whew! Ano si Chucky sa baba? Oh, sabi niya kay Yari kayo, lamon kayo sa aking dalawa. O oh, ang popogi niyo pa naman, lamon kayo. Diba? As with most images, this one doesn't have much info, but it seems pretty obvious as to what's happening in the picture. However, I have no explanation for whatever this is. It's hard to make out what this is, but it seems that a bodiless head had been caught in the background. This might be due to pareidolia, but the more you look at it, the more it seems like an actual head. 